Hey friends, this is Brandon from This Is Tech Today, and we're going to compare four different devices. So Google has released in the 2XL's November security update three different color profiles. There's the boosted mode, which is originally the vivid mode, the neutral mode, which is the option without the vivid mode, and then finally a new saturated mode. And because of that, we need to see what has changed with this update. So we'll be comparing four different phones. The first one will be a normal 2XL with just the normal vivid setting. So this is pre-November update. The second one will have the Oreo colorizer as an option. And then the third one has the saturation mode on. And then finally, we'll have the first generation Pixel XL at the default setting. So in terms of brightness, I don't really see a dramatic difference. There might be a tiny bit of brightness lost on the November update, but it's really hard to notice unless you have the two phones next to each other. So one thing that I already noticed about the saturated feature on the November update is that the reds look normal. It doesn't have this brownish look to it that's really unusual. And the original Pixel XL actually has a more orange look to the reds than I was expecting. So here's a comparison between all four devices looking at the red tones. As you can see, the first two have more brownish look to it. Some people have compared it to kind of a, a dried blood look, which is kind of disgusting, but it's accurate. And then the saturated one looks like a proper red, if not a little bit too cartoony. Now the blue shift is still there. When we look at the white tones of the device, it tends to have a more of an orange look to it. Uh, and so it, it covers up the blue a little bit, but it's, it's still there. Now here's the comparison actually with the November update between the different modes. You have your boosted, you have your natural, and then you have your saturated. As usual, the boosted and natural, it's very hard to tell the difference between the two. There, there is a minor difference there, but the saturated one is just crazy. It's, it's a significant difference. It's way more than even the Oreo colorizer. So we're switching between the different modes of the Oreo colorizer here, and we can see that there is a boost to it when we turn on the colorizer, and oddly enough, in the 1.1 release, it changed the optimized feature. So the optimized being turned off actually makes it look a little bit more bold or saturated than when you had it on. And then here's an HDR comparison between the normal default setting on the 2XL and then the saturated mode. It's interesting because they look very similar. The only difference that I can notice is perhaps it looks a little bit warmer, but in terms of saturation, it looks like it's the same. Like I mentioned in my previous video, the HDR mode enables a saturation mode that was already there. And so whatever they enabled in the November update is just whatever kicks in when you're watching an HDR video. And like I mentioned, the only difference is it's a little bit warmer in its tones. So if you want to find out how to enable the saturation feature on your Android device, here's what you'll do. Go into your quick settings. Remember, there's a two finger swipe down to get to the full menu if you want to do that. Hit the gear icon, click on display, and then click on advanced. And then under colors, you'll see the different options. So there's the natural one, which is kind of blue looking, and then the boosted one, which is essentially the vivid option, and then saturated, and that's it. So. What are your thoughts? What are your observations? Do you like the new saturated mode and will you enable it? Or do you prefer the more natural colors? For me, the saturation seems a bit much, but the colors are more accurate. It's really unfortunate that they didn't do any calibration on the natural or the boosted setting because I would prefer to use that instead. Hopefully Google will fix that. And you know what? They're listening. So let's speak up, let's tweet at them, let's share this video and let them know that, hey, we want them to calibrate the natural and the boosted setting as well. So the colors are correct on all different settings, saturated or not. Hey, and I know I promised that I would have a video showing the audio issues with the Pixel 2 XL when you're filming video. That's still coming. I wanted to put this video out first since it's so urgent. And I also wanted to see if there's a difference between the audio quality on video after the November update. And I have a bad feeling that there isn't a change. We'll find out. I also have a comparison video coming up between the Note 8 and the 2XL in terms of its display and its sound. If you found this video helpful, please help this small YouTuber out by giving me a thumbs up and subscribe and leave some comments down below. There's a lot more comments than I'm used to, but I'll still try my best to interact with every single one of you. Just wanna say welcome to all my new subscribers. My channel has had a significant amount of growth. I'm so thankful for you. And you may have noticed that my setup is a little bit different. It's because I've been moving into a different room. So I'm filming this video real quick while I'm doing that. Hey, and if you didn't know, I have a Patreon. And Ryan Dow is my first Patreon. So I thank you so much for being able to support me and to believe in me. So make sure you're subscribed. Thank you once again for watching This Is Tech Today. Until next time.